Hey, what's going on everybody? We are hoping to finish up, well, get close to it anyways, the expansion of the turnaround area out of our property. You can see, let's see, that's 40, 40 yards, which is 60 tons or 120,000 pounds, if I'm doing all my math correctly, of 22A gravel right there. We're gonna put it kind of where the Kubota tractor is in between the existing drive, moving it out this way so that when trucks come in off the road with trailers, it's easier for them to turn around. So we started this area last December using a rear blade, got a lot of the topsoil out, but I do see there's still some left in here. So we're gonna use the box blade, I already had that on the Kubota, and figure, hey, since it's down here, we'll use the bucket on the Kubota too move this out, may come back through with the box blade and kind of spread it out and smooth it out a bit. Our plan is to come back through everything, all 2,000 foot of it, and top it off with 21 AA, probably another four, five, six inches of that material as well. So if you're looking for inspiration on how to accomplish your new driveway, maintain it, refresh it, whatever it is, we've had all sorts of driveway videos that we've done as we've kind of figured this out along the way as we go, the things that work well, the things that don't. So make sure you check out all the past videos we have and hit that subscribe button to see more. And so today we're using the big Kubota M4 tractor. This is a utility tractor, but we used all sorts of sizes of tractors out here. Uh, anything from a subcompact, you know, up to a midsize to a large compact, like a 4720, which is a 66 horsepower compact. So they're gonna make box blades to fit, land planes, rear blades, rakes, whatever you need. They're gonna make it in a size to fit your machine. And we sell and ship these attachments all around the country. Bought this property with these kinds of projects in mind to show you guys what the tools are all about, the different sizes, different machines and setups that you can use to see what's the best fit for your needs. It's a chilly April day. It'll feel pretty good inside that cab there. So let's get to work. <music> Thank you. 
as always, we're sponsored by Bora Wheel Spacers. They are made in America, have a lifetime warranty. If your tractor feels tippy side to side, especially if you have a cab on it, then adding a set of wheel spacers can make a big difference. Get more information on them at the link down below. so that's a pretty good job there with the box blade getting out the rest of the topsoil it's kind of right at the edge of the bottom of the topsoil and then top of the uh, the clay and the sand and everything that's the layer right underneath it so i think i'm going to be in pretty good shape i did i did find a few more stumps got one here another one over there uh, another small one here i'm going to go ahead and grab the stump puller or the stump wrecker i should say and, and dig these out with the 1025r and i think just to have some fun see how long it takes i'm going to use the 1025r with my bucket on there the heavy hitch tooth bar see if we can spread that 120,000 pounds of gravel out here and see how long it takes. But the weather's breaking just a little bit. It'd be nice to get outside the cab, get some fresh air. So stick around for that video. Hit that subscribe button right down below. We sell all sorts of tractor attachments for the front end loader, the three point hitch. For the big guys here, the little guys like the 1025R and everything in between. So we sell and ship all over the country every day of the week. Check out goodworkstractors.com, we're happy to help. I wanna thank you for taking time out of your day to stop by and until next time, stay safe. We'll see you soon.